Okay, this is Spencer from the Tampa Bay Wallpaper Installer. I have here, I'm just gonna show you a quick trick with tape. This tape is an inch and a quarter. And, where's my other one? This is just under an inch. This tape is really expensive. This is frog tape, and you use it on the most delicate surfaces. This comes from Sherwin-Williams. It's better than scotch. If you have to get tape, this stuff is the best. Scotch's tape, if you purchase it individually, unless you buy it in a sleeve, the, I call the company, they heat, they heat seal uh, their individual ones, and these things tend to get heated up and they stick. I wouldn't suggest that you buy 3M individually, uh, you know, in, in packages of one, at least get them in the packages of five because they tend to open up easily. These are always good. Anyway, this is expensive. And so what do you do if you don't have the one inch yellow tape? Well, here's a trick. Now, I don't have my utility knife on me, but I'm just going to tell you the trick. So, you know how you cut a bagel and you hold it like this and you ch ch So, you hold, the, you hold the, the tape flat on a table, and I'll, I'll make another video of this. You hold, it, you hold the tape, but for those of you who do this work, you'll, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. You put this on a flat counter, you take a utility knife, something with a sharp blade, or a retractable blade, and just like you would cut a bagel, you push it into the middle of it, right? And then you start turning the tape. You turn the tape with your blade all the way in there and you just keep turning it like that. And you, you, you push the blade in as far as you think you'll need this tape cut in half. When you get to the point at which you begin, you'll see that it, you, you, it meets up right in the middle. And what do you get by doing that? Well, you're doubling the amount of tape that you have without buying. You get the benefit of having the wider tape when you need it, but if you need this tape and you only need it for a small application, my suggestion to you is simply cut the thing in half. Now they do sell this tape in this size, but you may get stuck on a job where you need this and you don't want to spend $10 on the whole roll, so you cut it in half, all right? Sorry I didn't have the thing to show you, but for those of you who work with tape, maybe this can help you. It's something that I realized that while I was working, I said, you know, maybe I can cut this in half. And as long as you hold your hand steady while you're turning it, the blade comes exactly around the other side and it meets up. All right, well, if you find if you found that this uh, this suggestion is helpful to you, would you please click on the little like button and subscribe? I appreciate it. If you have any suggestions about how to extend your tape or what to do in 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 the use of your uh, frog tape, either the yellow or the uh, the green one, or any of the tape that you use to mask off areas that you don't want painted. Please let me know in the comments section. I welcome all comments, and I've learned a lot by your comments as well. Okay, thank you.